Well, I was going to use this for the first shot, but it fell over. Hey, what's going on everybody? DJ Goham here. Welcome back to the channel and welcome to new mods for Farming Simulator 19. Today we got 10 mods for you for all platforms. We have three new and four updates. In PC and Mac, we have one new and two updates. Let's check them out. First up today, new mods for all platforms. We have the Reich One WM XL. This is a lime and fertilizer spreader from Roy Christie VSR Mining, sir. This is going to hold 4,500 liters of solid fertilizer and lime as a 30 meter spread at 15 miles per hour. So pretty wide and pretty quick. We got a couple different colors. I will say the colors seem a little muted maybe, I'm not sure. Uh, but we'll just go in. So this is gonna be the main color. You see it's orange, doesn't really have a texture to it. It's almost like it's perfectly smooth. So I'm still trying to figure that out. We do have like a aged white, which gives it a bit of a texture, but still uh, it's, it's something something a little different about it. Uh, if you guys are familiar with A2 Studios colors, uh, those do start here at the pearl white and go down uh, to, I believe it's deep blue. Yeah, so if you guys are used to those. Well, you will have those. And then we have a design color as well. This is going to be the top of it. And that's kind of it, 18,000 bucks, and that will be all for you. You don't have to pay for any paint or color. Well, looks like, okay, looks like you do if you go down out of the custom colors. So keep that in mind as well. One thing I will say is the writing looks really, really similar to A2 Studios writing. I could be completely wrong on that, but it looks a whole lot like the TLX logo just attempted here anyway when you buy it heads up it's going to fall out of the sky and it's going to fall on its face so you are going to need to pick this back up fortunately it's got an area at the bottom where you can get some forks under there and you'll be just fine uh there you go yep i went with a nitro blue and i think a uh a new silver or something like that it's a bit large this is a jcb and uh 4220 which should work well with pretty much any fertilizer spreader in game uh, it's a little bit big. So maybe you want to go with like a, a larger medium tractor or maybe a smaller large tractor. And uh, I think you'll be all right from there. If we go in here, we can take a look. Fertilizer, lime, you've got both of those. Uh, we're just going to put in some lime right there and we'll turn it on. Okay, so, yep, definitely a 30 meter spread on the fertilizer. We'll do the lime just to double check and see. And we got a 30 meter spread on the lime as well. So there you go. That is the Reich One WMXL. And for you guys on consoles, this is going to take up a total of four slots. Next up, we got a new cultivator for all platforms. This is going to be the Lizard Breneg. It says it's in disc arrows, and that is totally, totally not true. It is in cultivators. Boom. And this is going to be 90 horsepower, require three meter. Oh, it's a three meter cultivator. Get out of here. Six miles per hour. It's slow too. It only takes up one slot, so at least there's that. And uh, it's going to cost you 8,800 bucks. Not a whole lot to that. And you've got a limited color palette. So I hope you like red, green, or blue. And your only other new mod for all platforms today are the flags of German federal states. Uh, some of these I don't know how to pronounce. So, uh, Württemberg, uh, I know Bavaria, Berlin, Brandenburg, uh, Bremen, uh, Hamburg, Hessen, uh, Hessen, maybe? I don't know. Anyway, there's a bunch of them in here. So if you guys are looking for some German federal state flags, ta da! We gotcha. And uh, that's a big flag. There you go. All right. Making our way into mod updates for all platforms today. First up is going to be the Annaberger HTS 11D04 Tandem for Vertex Design version 1.0.1. Small improvements to the model. This is one of the most detailed manure spreaders that we have in game. And I highly recommend that you guys check this out if you're looking for just some of the best mods that you could possibly use. And likewise, with the Annaberger HTS 11D04 non-tandem version, also version 1.0.11, small improvements to the model. So yes, you've got a tandem version and you have a single axle version. And do keep in mind as well, both of these will do manure and 
Lime. Your next update for all platforms today is going to be the Eurospand pack from Black Eyes Official Modding. This is going to be version 1.3, added a new model, the PXT Spreader. This is going to be doing fertilizer as well as lime. This is going to take up six slots if you guys are on console, holds 800 liters, 12 meter spread at 12 miles per hour. Main color, you have red or gray. We're going to stick it on red for today. Coming down into extensions, we have none. We have a small, which is going to bring you up to 1,200 liters, and that is it, 800 or 1,200 liters. Design, we have the, well, just back and forth between the, uh, was it, the Calvo and the Eurospan. And working with, we have, well, 4 meter and 12 meter. So it looks like it has a starting of 4 meters, so if you need to get some small work done, this might be the one for you. I know there's some of you guys out there using smaller maps who don't need these huge fertilizer spreaders. There's like 32 meter spread, stuff like that. Hey, this might be the one for you. Check it out, Eurospan pack. While we're talking about it real quick, in the Eurospan pack, you've got two other pieces as well, the uh, Zeus Jolly and the Electra Chrono. These are cedars. These come with the Eurospan pack, so you got fertilizer spreaders, but you also have cedars. So instead of, uh, yeah, I mean, you need to plow, cultivate, do anything like that. However, I mean, check this out. This will, you can change up color stuff. But you could do 3,000 liters of seed, change up the location, and 36 meter spread. This is a 36 meter cedar for all platforms where it's in a fertilizer spreader state. And you could do um, all of your normal crops. Weed, barley, oats, canola, soybeans, a cover crop, and grass. Yes, go check this out. Seriously, you're a span pack from Black Eyes Official Mining. Get it, get it, get it. This is like a top 10 mod for me. You need to have one of these. And your last mod update for all platforms today is going to be the Reich 120 version 1.2 added vinyl section. So let's go check out vinyl. No, nope, no, nope, that's not it. Here we go. Unreal capacity evidently is adding new vinyls. All right. Well, there you go. So you got some different vinyls. So it looks like the same vinyl, just different colors. Uh, you've also got an unreal capacity change to 300,000 liters. Uh, definitely a game of mine's bigger going on here <laughs> and they've added some more colors as well if we go up here into rim color um still a copy and paste from a two studios colors uh in the main color you're gonna see the same ones here also but some new ones at the top as well but it looks like just again copy and paste from a two studio colors and the same for design. Making our way into new mods for PC and Mac players today. We only have one of them, but it's great. This is the price table extension. This is a mod that extends the price and stock overview to include missing standard fill types. So you've got things like seeds, water, diesel, fertilizer, liquid fertilizer, digestate, pig food, lime, and herbicide here at the ends. Um, it does say you will need global company for this to work. So heads up, I <laughs> I have it in, uh, but it is right here, really cool. And it gives you an idea of what you've got. If you guys are like me, and maybe you like to keep seeds and fertilizer in a silo, well, this might be for you. Plus, tells you how much fuel you've got as well. I know that's very important. And we do have a couple updates for you. The first which is the Laverda M3 XOMC SLC, let's go, version 1.1 added. Oh yes, we've got a Fent version and you've got a Massey Ferguson version on here now. So not just the Laverda, they've also fixed the leveling of the wheels and fix some minor bugs. This is a really cool combine harvester. And if you guys are using a massively hilly map, you definitely want to give this a try. It's pretty sweet. And your only other mod update for PC players and your last mod today is going to be an update to Beat Harvest. This is going to be version 1.0.3. Fix the compatibility with the Maze Plus 1.5 and Forge Extension 1.4. Fix the missing normal maps restored. The mod has been renamed the Feed Pellets. They have been changed to Super Feed. And they have a new Polish translation. If you guys were using the Maze Plus mods, but you were unable to get this mod to work correctly now everything is going to be working in harmony and i highly recommend you use both of these together well guys that is going to be it for today's new mod video hope you enjoyed it if you did make sure you drop a like on it get subscribed to the channel if you're new and join the go ham fam make sure you turn your notification bells on as well so that you never miss daily farming simulator videos here on the channel a couple of you guys have been asking me about when giveaways for farming simulator 22 are going to be starting and i will have information releasing next friday october the first you don't want to miss it should be in the fact sheet video that day as long as we have some all being said hope you have a great day and we'll see you later
Peace.